Well, you know, uh, when we look at some of the unemployment numbers that are here in Montgomery County and specifically who those are, we look at them as being young minority youth. And so it's one of those things where I certainly support uh, trying to make sure that some people who are already employed uh, are able to make more money. That's certainly something we all support. But we can't forget about those young people, those minorities that continue to struggle to be able to find jobs here in Montgomery County. And so we've got to do a better job of that before we focus on doing the other things which are helping people to get a higher salary. What I'm focused on is getting people a salary to begin with and that's where our focus needs to be at this point. This is this is coming from young people across the county but specifically in my district when I look at Montgomery Village, when I look at Gaithersburg, when I look at Germantown, when I look at those areas of young people who come to us and say I haven't had an opportunity to have a job. I haven't had an opportunity to get workforce experience and then when it comes to them if they're able to go to college go out and go try and join the workforce with no workforce experience at all, where some of their other counterparts do have that. That makes a tremendous difference and continues to contribute to those gaps that we see between our minority and non-minority uh, constituents and residents. And so from that perspective, it's something that we've got to take seriously. Uh, it's something that we have to put at the forefront in terms of making sure that we're connecting people to career ladders and pathways. And that can't happen through raising a minimum wage. That happens through a robust job program that really gets to the core of what it is I'm trying to achieve. You know, the key is is that um, I had asked for some time. Uh, I didn't see why we wanted to push this forward right now. We have a budget cycle that's before us, and once that budget cycle came through, a number of the proposals that I'm presenting to the county executive and then to the council about budgetary funds to make sure that these programs are supported is the right way in which we could have gone about this and then talk about increasing the minimum wage. But for some reason, advocates wanted to focus on this was the time. And so from that perspective, I can't support that right now without having the support for this robust jobs program. It certainly is a possibility, and I've been in conversations with the county executive about what my priorities are and what I care about. And so from that perspective, I'm not sure what the county executive's gonna do. I do know this, is that regardless of how this plays out, we have got to do more when it comes to making sure that we're employing more of our young people, more of our minorities here in Montgomery County. They double the rates of their white counterparts, uh, and that's a tremendous concern and not something that a lot of people are talking about.